house means other things to other people. And like, you know, we don't have that problem in the house. Not yet anyway. But like, oh, we never have that. Maybe if we all had it, it'd be a bit weird, wouldn't it? We'd have different issues. But anyway, I'm just sitting there now trying not to get the dose. I'm the only one in the house, the only one with the compromised immune system, is the only one without the dose yet. So I'm just waiting for it, right? I've got myself locked in the bedroom. But, uh, you know, you know, it's only just so long before you, like, I got my, my hands rub raw and everything like that, washing them all the time, trying to keep it away, right? So that's how they says you should keep away flu, is that you should try to, like, you know, contain the bug, which is hard when you're living in the house with it, but you always got to wash your hands. Now I got my hands rub right raw, and uh, so then putting on creams and stuff like that because my hands are so dry, and uh, I don't know why, but my lips are dry, and I got my favorite lip balm. Oh, do you know what it's called? Can't wait. Whoa, dropped it. Bear Erst. Yeah, it's backwards on here. I don't know why, but anyway, it's called Bear Erst. And anyway, it's my favorite. Absolutely loves it. I bought it out in St. John's one time, and now I order it all the time because I really like it. But it's, um, it smells like coconut and chocolate, but like... I wonder how they got the name, right? Because, like, I never, my eyes don't smell like that. But then again, I don't go around checking other people's, right? So you never know, it makes me wonder about my own. But, anyway, I like it, and I should try, probably just take what it is. Probably better off not, it's better off not knowing where the name came from. Anyway, I like it for my lips. Yeah, pretty nice, I love it. But, so what else I do since last week? Oh yeah, I went to St. John's because, you know, that's always a pleasure. And uh, I went out there and went to Costco. I know those people out in St. John's are right crooked now because they're moving to Costco. And I know it was inconvenient because to finger drive, you know, it's such a pleasure. But imagine if you had to drive three and a half hours to go to the Costco because that's what I got to do. Cracks me up. You're going around the Costco and like you got a cart full of groceries so I never goes out of there for less than three, four hundred dollars. And then uh, looks over and the next person next to me got one thing in their cart. I can't even imagine going into Costco for one thing. Would it, like I wouldn't even venture into the madness. But Maybe I'm missing out on something. Have you ever had anything at Costco that was so good that you'd go in and get just that one thing? Let me know what it is, because maybe I'm missing something. But anyway, I value my time and my sanity a little too much for that. But anyway, who knows? I might be missing something. So if I am, let me know. Right? But uh, the whole way out there, someone else drove, right? So I had on the, I had on the, the, the travel pillow. I love that. It wraps it around your head, right, and lies back. And then for Christmas, Mother gave me the, the mask, travel mask, right? And you just, and it blocks out all the light. You can't see a thing. It was the best thing she ever gave me, right? Now, if she could only give me noise-canceling headphones, I'd be set. I wouldn't be able to see her or hear her, right? But... Anyway, two out of three ain't bad. It was lovely. I love those magic pillows that goes around the neck, right? And mine's made a memory from them. Like, it freaks me right out, right? Because it's just a great big fuzzy pillow. And then you fold it up and fold it up and fold it up and fits into this little tiny envelope. Yeah, imagine. Like, and then as soon as you, t as soon as you take it out, it springs right back to where it was. Kind of like when I take off my Spanx. Same thing. Anyway, so that's what I'm doing today. Nothing. Just blazing around, trying not to get the dose. And I hope you guys don't get the dose either. And uh, take care of yourself. Make sure you wash your hands and stay away from people who got the dose. And also, if you got the dose, don't go out. Right? Don't go spreading it to other people. I don't want to. Anyway, I hope you have a good day. See ya.